Hello everyone, welcome back to Flourish Field. In this video, we are going to be looking at how to create a currency converter app in Scratch. As you can see, I have my Scratch environment right here and we're ready to start creating the project. Now to start with, you need to first sign in. Alright, so if you do not know how to sign in, there's a link at the top right corner that will show you how to sign in to the Scratch community. Alright, so now let me sign in. All right now, so this is my Scratch platform and um, I'm ready to create. All right, so this is my Scratch platform, this is my username. So all I need to just do is to create, click on the create um, link and then it takes me to the project area. So I'll start writing, developing my project. Now the first thing I would want to do is to I'll uh, give my project a name. I'm going to give it what? Currency, currency converter app. Currency converter app. All right. And um, I'm going to start, you know, building on the platform. Now, the first thing I want to do is to paint my backdrop. I want to be able to paint the backdrop by myself. And... Um, well, probably no. Don't let us paint the backdrop for now. Let me select, let me choose a backdrop. And in this case, I'm going to be picking, I'm going to be selecting blue sky. Alright, so I'll be, I'll be picking blue sky as my backdrop. And I'm going to select a character. Well, in this case, I'm going to select this. Uh, you could actually change the costume by selecting any of all of this. Alright, as you can see. I'm going to go with this and I'm going to put it at the center. So now it's time for us to start coding. Now this is the platform for our currency converter app and then what this will do is it's going to be acting us um, the amount of money that we want to convert from Naira to dollar or to pounds or to Canadian dollar. So those are the three currency we'll be converting our Nairas to. So we're going to be converting um, Nairas to dollar. So, I think it's a nice thing for us to add a sprite that will display the text right there. I think it's a nice idea. So, I'll go to paint a sprite and um, I'm going to pick a color that would go with this. So, let's select a color uh, that would actually blend with this. I need something black or something dark. And then I'm just going to say um, currency. No, let me select a font family. I'm going to select something that is bold and I'm going to write what currency converter up. Now let me write in all capital letters. Currency converter up. Alright, so that's it. Um, yeah, so I wanted to, you know, something big. Uh, currency converter up. Alright. And then we could actually place it wherever I want to place it. All right, that's it. That's our currency cover app right there at the back of the. And then the next thing we now to want to do now is to make our sprites talk. And then we obviously will start with a with an event, and then we'll see when flag is clicked. So that is our first instruction. So when flag is clicked is an event. So it means that whenever we want to click on this flag, whatsoever code we have right there shall be executed by this. So let's not make that mistake. Let's select the sprite and then let's put in when flag is clicked. So this is a sprite that I'm selecting. So that when I click on this flag now, this sprite would um, execute whatever code we have right there. So the first code that we want to do is, I feel this is too big. This sprite is too big. I want to reduce the size. All right. So all I need to do is just to go to looks and uh, scroll down to set size. And I'm going to set the size to 70. All right. That's fine. Aha. Uh -huh. So now, so that when I click on the flag now, you can see now that we have something the beats normal right now so that we that's where we have um the size 70 
Um, another thing that we want to do is maybe probably we want this um, text to move left and right continuously until we end that. So you come to the text, you click on when flag is clicked, and um, now we want it to glide to the left and the right. So all you need to do is just go to motion, uh, scroll down to glide. You see that glide. Now, because we want it to move to the left and to the right, you would actually leave um, leave the y coordinate and then focus on the x coordinate. Now, let's start with a negative sign, say negative negative sixty, and then move to, from negative sixty to positive ten. I think that's fine. So let's check that out. So when I click on it, left right so you could even increase it to negative 30 i think that's better so let's go again left right that's it but now we want it to move continuously all right we want to animate our text now to make it move continuously you go to control and then you use the word the forever loop yes we want it to just keep moving like that so now so now when we click on flag now it keeps going on the forever look like that. So we've been able to animate our texts. And that's the first thing we have done right there. So now let's come back to our sprite and continue with our coding. So stop. Now what we want to do now is we want this sprite to say some words to introduce us to the converter app. So to do that, you go to looks and then you use the save lock. So we're going to be saying a lot of things. All right. So I'm going to select like five and then I'm going to say hello everyone oops I'm supposed to use a small letter hello everyone hello everyone and then the next one will be what welcome to flourish from currency converter oops flourish currency converter currency converter um this app this app would this app will convert from naira to either dollars pounds or Canadian dollars all right that's it and then uh, we're gonna say some words like um, to convert from Naira to dollars click the dollar sign dollar sign all right so just hold on for this dollar sign so let's duplicate this duplicate it again so what we're, we're apparently just using the save lock now the next one we want to convert from dollars from naira to pounds in case you don't know naira is the currency used in nigeria i'm proud of my country and um that is so we are trying to convert from naira to dollars and pounds and canadian dollars so click on the pound sign pound sign and then the next one will go from naira to canadian dollars yes we are converting from naira to canadian dollars canadian dollars click on the cs sign or click on yeah something cs sign all right so this is our app and um, so when you click on the flag now it goes hello everyone welcome to flourish converter app this app will convert from now it's not allowing me to read so i need to um, set the timer so this first one could be three minutes this next one could be because it's longer than the rest so this one could be five minutes this one could be four minutes just you know pick a timing that would look nice this one could be 
um, let's still use uh, four minutes for now. So now let's check it out right now. Let's see. Hello everyone. Welcome to my Flourish Currency Converter. This app will convert from Naira to either dollars, pounds, or Canadian dollars. To convert from Naira to dollars, click the dollar sign. To convert from Naira to pounds, click the, the, the pound sign. And to convert from Naira to Canadian dollar, click the CS sign. That's it. So now we've been able to first create a text that moves. And then we've been able to use save logs to display our uh, to display our information but now we want to add one more thing we want to make this sprite speak so that we can actually engage the users okay now to do that we need to add another extension it's called the text to speech extension now how do we do that you come right here click on this blow this plus sign and then you select what text to speech now when you select set text to speech it's going to avail us with three blocks of code we have the speak we have the set voice and then we have the set language so now that is what we're going to do right now so now let's first um create another event that would actually enable the sprites to talk and now in this case we're still going to use what when flag is clicked because we want the action to happen simultaneously what i mean by simultaneously is we want it to happen together so that means to say that means that we want the sprites to speak and at the same time display the text on the screen all right so when i click on the flag right now i want everything to happen at the same time now to do that i'll say when flag is clicked i go to text to speech and i i select what the voice type now set voice to what um let me select tenor i want it to be a male voice and then the next thing for for us to do is start is to start, start speaking all of this so you just drag out the speak block let's drag i mean how many are we dragging we're dragging one two three four five six so let's drag it out two three four five and six now the next thing you know start doing is to copy and paste the text copy and paste text in the speak block remember we want it to happen simultaneously so now let's do that that's it and then we'll go to the third one that's it uh, go to the fourth one and then you that's it you go to the fifth one that's it and then you go to the sixth one that's it so now we have been able to speak and at the same time say but now let's check out our code let's check out our project is before we actually decide on anything now let's go so when i click on flag now hello everyone you see that welcome to flourish currency converter this app will convert from Naira to either dollars, pounds, or Canadian dollars. To convert from Naira to dollars, click the dollar sign. To convert from Naira to pounds, click the pound sign. To convert from Naira to Canadian dollars, click the CS sign. Fortunately, I guess the timing actually worked with... Um, what we have right there maybe probably because we have actually gave the time so i don't think there's anything this i don't think there's any need for us to wait but if you try it by uh, on your own and then you discover that you have any challenges you can always use the comment section to ask your question i would be there to answer all of the questions now let's run it one more time to to check if this is actually working hello everyone welcome to flourish currency converter this app will convert from Naira All right, to so dollars, it's, yeah. pounds, or Canadian dollars. To convert from Naira to dollars, yeah. click the dollar sign. To convert from Naira to pounds, click the pound sign. To convert from Naira to Canadian dollars, click the CS sign. Now, can you see that it's it's not it's not working properly? Now, the reason is because we 
we, we did not actually tell when this right to, to speak this next word. All right. We did not actually tell the sprites to wait. And that's, that's, that's a challenge. Now let's run again and let's see. Hello everyone. Welcome to Flourish see? Currency Converter. Now, will convert from there. what I feel is we could actually tell it to wait a second. And now, now let's check it out now. That's for the first one. After the hello everyone. Now let's check it out now. Hello everyone. Welcome to Flourish Currency Converter. This app will convert. Now that's worked. That's worked. Now, after the first one also, let's tell it to wait again. And then let's run it again now. Let's check it out. Hello everyone. Welcome to Flourish Currency Converter. This app will convert from Naira to Eva dollars, pounds, or Canadian dollars. To convert from Naira to dollars, click. So to play save, I feel uh, we could actually tell it to wait after us. Speaking. Let's try that. Let's let's tell it to wait one, one second after speaking. Now let's run it all together. Let's see. Now I think that's where the challenge Hello, is. Hello everyone. Welcome to Flourish Currency Converter. I think that's better. This app will convert from Naira to either dollars, pounds, or Canadian dollars. To convert from Naira to dollars, click the dollar sign. To convert from Naira to pounds. Click the pound sign. To convert from Naira to Canadian dollars, click the CS sign. Alright, I think there's still another challenge. Um, why not let's just make it with 5-5 five, five seconds to see if that will work. Let's just hold on. I think that's just where the challenge is. Alright, now let's go again. You just have to calculate. Hello everyone. You just have to calculate. Let's see. Welcome to Flourish Currency Converter. This app will convert from Naira to either dollars, pounds, or Canadian dollars. To convert from Naira to dollars, click the dollar sign. To convert from Naira to pounds, click the pound sign. To convert from Naira to Canadian dollars, click the CS sign. I think it's better that way. All right, so that is it. So we are we have been able to um, make our sprite speak and at the same time display the text. That is the first thing that we have done, and that is going to be the part one. Of this currency convert up now in the next video i'm going to show you how to display those sign after the sprite uh, finish talking so after the sprite finish speaking i'm going to show you how to display those sign after the sprite finish speaking and um, that's what i'm going to show you in the next video and then how to also convert from naira to dollars from naira to pounds or from naira to CS um, to, to Canadian dollars. I hope you enjoy this. I hope you're, you're able to do all of these. In the next video, I want you to actually follow along with this video so that we can actually um, graduate to the next video. Um, all right. So until then, I want you to stay blessed and keep flourishing. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment in the comment section below. Now.